Good morning. I'm Jane Lush and I'm the chair of BAFTA and I'm delighted to welcome you all to BAFTA's HQ here at 195 Piccadilly for the announcement of the nominations for this year's EE British Academy Film Awards. I want to begin, if I may, by addressing the troubling revelations of the grave, unacceptable practices that have recently been revealed within our industry. On Sunday night at the Golden Globe, Seth Meyers skewered it as only he can, brilliantly, hilariously, and honestly. Others, including Oprah Winfrey, used it as a clarion call for change, something we at BAFTA wish to wholeheartedly endorse. We too are determined to ensure that the brave revelations, and make no mistake, they were very brave, become a watershed moment to be a catalyst for real, lasting change across the workplace in film, games and television. For 70 years now, BAFTA has been identifying the very best films and performances, showcasing them to the world, celebrating the skill and creativity of the talented women and men in front of and behind the camera who bring such an array of incredible stories to life. It's why we at BAFTA feel so strongly about working together to reset the tone. In a cross-industry initiative with, amongst others, the British Film Institute, Women in Film and Television, and Directors UK, we are pooling our knowledge and resources to develop a unified set of principles and guidelines aimed at stamping out pernicious work practices that thrive in outdated power structures. BAFTA unequivocally promotes a professional environment sorry, Otaq went, professional environment that protects all who work in it from bullying or harassment. We'll be publishing these guidelines very shortly. It's not only me too, but it's we too. So now, to the 2018 nominations. Our 6,500 BAFTA members have watched and pondered over hundreds, if not thousands, of hours of film. And as a result of their deliberations, we can announce the nominations for our awards, so it's all rather thrilling. Nine categories will be revealed here with the full list handed out as you leave, and all categories will also be published on our website. Before we start, here's a reminder of the EE Rising Star Award nominees we announced last week. And after the nominations, I'll be revealing our new host for 2018, taking over from the wonderful Stephen Fry. But now, to announce the nominations, please welcome two hugely talented people, Letitia Wright, a BAFTA Breakthrough Brit in 2015 and soon to be seen in Black Panther, and Natalie Dormer, who you'll know from Game of Thrones and Hunger Games, and soon to have her first feature writing credit with In Darkness, in which she also stars. Letitia and Natalie, please reveal the nominations. <laughs> Good morning. I know how much it means to have the support and recognition of BAFTA behind you, so it's a real privilege to be here announcing this year's nominations with Natalie. The nominations for Supporting Actress are Alison Janney for I, Tonya, Kristen Scott Thomas for Darkest Hour, Laurie Metcalf for Lady Bird, Leslie Manville for Phantom Thread, and Octavia Spencer for The Shape of Water. The nominations for Supporting Actor are Christopher Plummer for All the Money in the World, Hugh Grant for Paddington 2, Sam Rockwell for Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri, Willem Dafoe for The Florida Project, and Woody Harrelson for Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. The nominations for Adapted Screenplay are James Ivory for Call Me By Your Name, Armando Iannucci, Ian Martin, and David Schneider for The Death of Stalin, Matt Greenhouse for Film Stars Don't Die in Liverpool, Aaron Sorkin for Molly's Game, Paul King and Simon Farnaby for Paddington 2. The nominations for Original Screenplay are Jordan Peele for Get Out, Stephen Rogers for I, Tonya, Greta Gerwig for Lady Bird, Guillermo del Toro and Vanessa Taylor for The Shape of Water, Martin McDonough for Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. The nominations for directors are Denis Villeneuve 
for Blade Runner 2049, heard some cheering there. <laughs> Luca Guadagnino for Call Me By Your Name. Christopher Nolan for Don Kirk. Guillermo del Toro for The Shape of Water. Martin McDonough for Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. The nominations for Leading Actress are Annette Benning for Film Stars Don't Die in Liverpool, Frances McDormand for Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri, Margot Robbie for I, Tonya, Sally Hawkins for The Shape of Water, and Saoirse Ronan for Lady Bird. The nominations for Leading Actor are Daniel Day-Lewis for Phantom Thread, Daniel Kaluuya for Get Out, Gary Oldman for Darkest Hour, Jamie Bell for Film Stars Don't Die in Liverpool, Timothy Chalamet for Call Me By Your Name. The nominations for Outstanding British Film are Darkest Hour, The Death of Stalin, God's Own Country, Lady Macbeth, Paddington 2, and Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. The nominations for Best Film are Call Me By Your Name, Darkest Hour, Don Kirk, The Shape of Water, Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. And finally, these are the films with the most nominations. Take a closer look at the crafts behind the nominations and find out how these amazing films were made at BAFTA Guru. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Letitia uh, and Natalie. The winners will all be revealed at London's Royal Albert Hall on Sunday the 18th of February and the ceremony broadcast on BBC One. Now, it's time for me in to introduce the new host for our awards. I'm thrilled and honoured to welcome the hugely talented, exceptionally charismatic and recent recipient of the BAFTA Fellowship, Joanna Lumley. <laughs> Honestly, how exciting is this? It's just so unbelievably thrilling. Um, I always thought of looking at the, at the BAFTA films as with just Stephen Fry there forevermore. So who thought I'd turn into Stephen Fry? Thrilling! <laughs> Thank you. Um, it's, it's, uh, it's funny because I've been, I've been uh, voting for BAFTA for so long and knowing that 6,500 other people are voting for BAFTA, and yet every year when you hear the, the list of nominations coming out, some part of your heart is always going, oh, I do hope. And sometimes you go, yes, and sometimes you go, oh, no, they left that out. And so it's always a terrific kind of turmoil of, of uh, emotions. And uh, I don't have to be connected with that because I'm above it all now. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I'm thrilled and I want to thank BAFTA so much for asking me to do this. I said yes indecently quickly. <laughs> um, thank you, thank you. And I'll see you on the night anyway.